Daily Show correspondents anchor the show. All right, now, on the day after the Oscar nominations, as excited nominees start consulting their stylists, some fans and colleagues are still simmering over what many consider as a pair of colossal snubs. Both dinks involve the Barbie movie. Margot Robbie was not nominated for lead actress for her work as Barbie, prompting the Australia Today show to declare that omission as, quote, the snub of the century, which I think is a little much, but also the woman who directed the movie. Greta Gerwig not nominated for her directorial efforts, and that does seem like a genuine surprise, and it is a surprise to those who were nominated. Here are your best supporting actors. Sterling K. Brown leading off the names, which include Ken, played by Ryan Gosling from Barbie. Now, he's happy and not happy with the nomination. Ryan Gosling releasing this statement, I'm extremely honored to be nominated by my colleagues alongside such remarkable artists in a year of so many great films. And I never thought I'd be saying this, but I'm also incredibly honored and proud that it's for portraying a plastic doll named Ken. But there's no Ken without Barbie. And there's no Barbie movie without Greta Gerwig and Margot Robbie, the two people most responsible for this history-making, globally celebrated film, another Oscar nominee with a great personal story. Actress Lily Gladstone has won several Oscar precursors and is an Oscar nominee. And this is no surprise to those who've known Lily for a long time, especially those who went, who went to high school with her. Look at this. It's Lily's yearbook photo, and it says, most likely to win an Oscar. Certainly did not disappoint. That is your entertainment report here in Hollywood. I'm Sam Rubin. All right, Rubin, thanks for all that Hollywood updates. Lots going on all the time, yeah. Yeah. right? I love being updated on entertainment news. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's always right. something going on. Right there, right. Well, your time now is 5.57. Every time you head out the door is 6 a.m. You got a couple of minutes to do that, get to up. get up, get ready, get out of bed. Sometimes it's hard when it's a little cooler outside to oh, get out of bed. Yes. You just want to stay under the blanket yeah. and stay there. But I, I also want to give a shout out to Rosie Hernandez for watching us oh, almost every morning. I think hi, she watches. Rosie. Good morning, Rosie. Thanks for oh, watching gosh. us. We appreciate you. Oh, yes, definitely. Yeah, and we sure. love your name. Name, Rosie, that's such a pretty name. Yeah, I love that sure. name. Mm -hmm. Awesome. We appreciate you so much. Yeah, yeah. well, we still got a lot to come for this next <laughs> hour, but you mm -hmm. know, for people that are going to head out the door in a couple of minutes here, oh, what yes. should they expect? Well, they can expect dry conditions, which is really okay. good news. So yeah. you don't have to be in a rush or get that rain gear, but hopefully it's it's in your car already, <laughs> uh, just in case, especially if you live in Cameron County, because that's the area where.